and you get to talk to all these various pastors and, and hear their stories, hear about their ministry and what they are going through. And I praise God and I thank God that because of you folks, I'm embarrassed to share my testimony with them because I don't want them to know how good I have. Because that's the way it is. I feel funny about it. But because of how you guys treat me and all kids, the whole family, this whole cooperative ministry, I feel so blessed and I am so thankful that I have you folks to serve and not what I hear about. And I thank God for that. And it's very, very humbling at times when I sit down and I'm in prayer and I think about what I have here in New Bethlehem compared to other clergy. And I, I just feel a, 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 a great unworthiness there again. Why me? Why was I blessed? Why was I called? Why was I selected? I still answer or ask those questions. I know the answer, but I still ask them. But I thank you. I thank New Salem. I thank Putneyville. I thank Hawthorne. I thank Leisure Run, Oak Ridge, Fairmont City. And you folks who do know. Because you certainly, you know, Jody, Jody made this very aware to me long before I even took over, but I knew what I was going into right from the start. And her and I, we don't get together and we don't talk about it. And I do know that when that time comes, another pastor has to come in here. I know what I'm going to tell them. You're going to be loved. You're going to be welcomed and you're going to be loved. So you better get used to it. Thank you. And praise God. Let us uh, close in prayer. Gracious and merciful God, we know that because of your grace upon us, we do have much to be thankful for. We do thank you and praise you for your involvement in our lives, for your salvation and for your eternal life. Help us to live thankful lives every day and not just on the day we designate as a holiday. Help us to share our thankfulness to our neighbor through our personal witness of thanksgiving in our daily lives. We pray these things in Jesus' name. Amen. Our closing hymn is number 2070 in your uh, black hymnal. Uh, he is exalted. Let's just sing it one time through. I know it's hard two times, but it's a few couple minutes after 12 here. Let's just sing it one time through. 2070.
Let us go into our communities. Let us go back with our families and our friends. Let us go back to work. Living a life that is full of thanksgiving because we have you in our hearts. We do thank you and praise you for everything that you bless us with. In Jesus Christ's precious name, we pray and we praise. And all God's people said, Amen.